So as many of you know, Tesla added the ability to run Steam Beta on the newest Teslas, particularly the Model S and the Model X late last year. And while it's been great, you can basically run any game that you can run on Steam Deck in any other console, whether it's a gaming rig or portable devices. The limiting factor is the storage space that's available on Teslas. Right now, our Tesla Model X only provides about 100 gigabytes of space for a game, other things that you need to save using Steam Deck. But we're going to remedy that by installing an external hard drive, uh, an, an SSD specifically. And the one that I have in my hand is a Samsung T7 Shield, which is shockproof, drop proof, it operates in a wide variety of temperatures. And most importantly, it's far cheaper than the SSD that Tesla sells on its website. And so we're just going to go through the installation process. It's a very simple installation basically just requires um, inserting the USB-C port on the side of the drive and then inserting the USB-A portion into the glove box and replacing the existing flash drive that's used to store Sentry Dash cam footage. All right, so here's the glove box of the Model X open. As you can tell, this is the factory installed flash drive that's used for Sentry mode and dash cam footage. We're going to remove that and we're going to replace it with our SSD drive. So, as I mentioned earlier, this is the USB-A side and it's gonna go right into the USB port over here. All right, so there you go. SSD drive installed and the beauty of this is that it's locked securely in the glove box. So uh, it can be easily taken. It requires a, a pin code to unlock the glove box. So from the arcade and Steam Beta screen, we're gonna hit Format USB Drive. So it's asking us, do we want to format the USB drive for use with Steam? But it'll, it's also asking if we want to have a certain amount devoted to dash cam. So yes, we want that. So we're gonna hit Format. There's a message that says it's formatting the USB drive for Steam. So we'll wait for that to complete and we'll see what happens. All right, so it looks like our SSD has finished formatting, so we're gonna go check to see that it's recognized by Steam. And here from the general menu, we're gonna go to storage. And as you can see, the internal drive has about almost 80 gigabytes of storage, but here, which is the external storage, we have you know, close to uh, a little bit over 850 gigabytes free. The difference between that and the full terabyte on the SSD as it's rated is the portion that's devoted to the sentry mode and dash cam footage. All right, so let's see if we can download a game that I'll actually take advantage of the expanded storage space. Okay, so let's see how this works when we actually want to install something. So I'm just going to pick a demo game that I want to install just for demonstration. You click install. It's going to ask you, do you want to install it on the internal drive or your external drive? And so obviously going forward, since the external drive has much more space, we're going to select that and it's going to install it on the external drive. Well, I hope you found that useful and hopefully adding an SSD drive will vastly improve your Tesla Steam Deck experience. Um, I know it's. I'm looking forward to having a lot more spaced install the games that I actually want to play on the Model X. Yeah, let me know if this works out for you. I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks.